So, second day in a row here where well, we've got a nice rainy day here in Yokohama. And the port doesn't open for another half an hour, and so I came here, I guess, early to get organized and to make sure that I didn't have any emails. And I've got some free time, so I thought I'd show you what we have here and exactly how many skylines are here. Now, keep in mind, this is only one of the ports that we use. We use two different ports. And uh, this one is mostly U.S. cars. The other one has some U.S. cars in it at the moment. But let's take a look at, uh, at cars we've got here. Okay, CRX here, Skyline GTR with work wheels, Workmeister S1s, my favorite wheel of all time, something special over there, Skyline GTR, Sylvia Turbo, more Sylvia Turbo, Skyline GTR, Skyline GTR, my first ever NSX. Very excited to see that one. We haven't checked that one yet. Uh, that's not mine. That's not mine. All the boring cars are not mine. Skyline GTR. Four door Skyline. More Skyline GTR. More Skyline GTR. More. And Toyota Crown. Hey, buddy. And very sad 8.6. This very sad 8.6 needs to be fixed. They wouldn't let it ship in this condition. And so we're going to have to get that fixed. Too bad. The car runs fine, though. Okay, so that is the port here in Yokohama. And my tiny little walk around video because I'm here. Wanted to get some videos. And just to kind of show you how popular these Skyline GTRs are with our company right now. Uh, all the GTRs in this section were bought from us. And so, there we have the Tsurumi Tsubasa Bridge. Here's my car. Uh, my other car should be registered by next Tuesday or Wednesday. We got some containers and stuff. This is a loading section for the containers. They put stuff into containers and then took them off. And they don't have a fence here, and so if you fall into the ocean, you die. And so it always makes me nervous when I'm shooting a video of a car. Sometimes we move the cars in here, which we can do if there's no cars blocking them and it's lunchtime, like it is right now. And then when I'm shooting the cars, I put the camera up to my face so that I can see, and I do the walk around of it, and I go, oh, it's scary. Because, like, to be honest, if you did fall in there, there, there isn't a ladder anywhere that I can see here to climb back in. And so you're basically relying on some, you know, shouting so somebody can hear you, and then them throwing some sort of rope in to catch you. Uh, it would be like standing on the edge of a cliff. Because, you know, there's nobody around here. So, my recommendation is don't fall in. Okay, so that's going to be it for the rainy day adventure. And it said that the rain would be down to 50% chance of rain by 1 o'clock. And so I'm really hoping that this stops raining before I shoot the videos of the cars. Not only are the cars wet right now, which is a little bit difficult to see the condition, but also when it's just raining like this, it makes everything miserable. I much prefer... Overcast is the best. Sunny, sunny is good, but when it's too sunny, then the contrast on the cars isn't very good. Uh, the exterior looks good, but the interior is hard to shoot when it's really bright. Overcast makes for the best, uh, I guess, most accurate and detailed pictures. Okay, so we're going to end up there. We're going to take a look at Tsubasa Bridge.